Welcome back to Missile and Jet Watch, the channel where we explore the latest breakthroughs in global defense systems and military aviation. Today our spotlight turns to the Philippines and a powerful new development that is making waves in the region. The subject is the Pilipinas Land Missile 2025, a system that many are calling the newest symbol of Filipino defense power. This missile represents more than just another weapon, it signals a major shift in the way the Philippines is approaching national security and military independence. For many years, the Philippines has depended heavily on imports and the support of allies for advanced weaponry. This created gaps, especially during times when international politics complicated access to critical systems. The arrival of the Pilipinas land missile shows that the country is serious about developing indigenous technologies to strengthen its armed forces. In 2025, this missile program stands as a milestone, highlighting both technological progress and a stronger commitment to self-reliance. The Pilipinas land missile is designed to serve as a versatile platform for long-range precision strikes. Reports indicate that it is capable of reaching targets at distances never before achieved by locally developed systems. Its purpose is not only to defend key territories but also to provide deterrence against any potential aggressor. The missile's guidance systems are believed to be equipped with modern navigation technology, ensuring high accuracy even under challenging conditions. This level of sophistication places the Philippines on a new tier of regional defense capability. One of the most important aspects of this project is that it is homegrown. Local engineers, scientists, and defense institutions have been working together to create a missile that fits the unique geographic and strategic needs of the archipelago. Unlike imported systems, which may not always align with the operational environment of the Philippines, this missile is specifically designed to perform in local conditions, whether it be coastal defense, island-to-island -island deployment, or integrated operations with the Army and Navy. The strategic implications of the Pilipinas land missile are significant. For the Philippine Army, it provides the ability to conduct standoff strikes, meaning they can hit critical targets from a safe distance. For the Navy and Air Force, it offers a complementary weapon that can enhance joint operations. Taken together, the presence of this missile means that the armed forces of the Philippines now has a credible deterrent against larger powers in the region. It does not make the Philippines a military superpower, but it ensures that any adversary will have to think twice before testing Philippine sovereignty. Beyond its military use, the project also boosts national pride and economic growth. The production of the missile involves local industries, creating jobs and expanding technical expertise. Universities and research institutions gain opportunities to train students in aerospace engineering, computer science, and defense technology. Over time, this knowledge base strengthens the country's ability to innovate in other fields as well, from civilian aerospace projects to advanced robotics. In this way, defense technology is not just about weapons, it becomes a driver of national development. Still, there are challenges. Developing advanced missile systems requires funding, research, and constant testing. Some components must still be sourced from abroad, and scaling up production to meet the needs of the armed forces will take time. Yet, despite these obstacles, the fact that the Pilipinas land missile has reached this stage by 2025 is a testament to determination and vision. In the bigger picture, this missile changes how the Philippines is perceived in the region. It shows that the nation is not content with being a passive player but is ready to invest in its own security and future. In an era of shifting alliances and rising tensions, the ability to stand independently is invaluable. The Pilipinas land missile is more than just hardware, it is a symbol of sovereignty, resilience, and national pride. Thank you for watching Missile and Jet Watch. Stay tuned for more updates on the Philippines' defense modernization, global missile systems, and the latest innovations shaping the future of warfare. Don't forget to subscribe and share your thoughts in the comments, what do you think about the rise of liking Pinoy defense technology?